Lee. Montgomery in towards the centre. Up they go on a strong mark taken by Michael Green. What a coverage we've got on the Channel 7 network today. Right throughout Australia, excepting Melbourne live. There they go on a great mark taken by Bradley Smith. How is that, Lou? On the 7 network, right throughout Australia, except here in Melbourne. Right, there's Bradley Smith kicking the ball around towards that uh, uh, wing. Oh, there's falling over that time, both players. But Wood was first to recover. Good play by Wood as he gets the ball back to Thorpe. Thorpe with a snapshot for goal. Doesn't make the distance. Packs set themselves. Punched away by Goodingham. Going out to the ball is Bartlett and Faltham. That goes past. Bartlett's got it now. There's a blind turn as he hooks the ball back. There's Ooh. a mark to Sheedy. Oh, don't tell me. He's well within kicking distance. He'd be about uh, 45 metres out from goal on a slight angle. And at this stage, Richmond are 20 points up. There he goes now. Kevin Sheedy. Played a very sensible game today. Taking his time. You can't rush this fellow. The kick. Oh, it looks pretty good. And it's a goal. Two minutes into the third quarter. 11 goals, 11, 77 Richmond. But off Melbourne, 8 3, 51. A difference of 26 points. And Lou, I understand from our sales department that we have a, a number of special friends watching in Sydney this afternoon who are vitally interested in the outcome of this match. Well, it's back to the centre now, waiting for umpire Robertson to throw the ball down. The Tigers leading by 26 points. Up it goes, a chance for Green. He gets the knockout to Bartlett, but taken away from by Sheedy. Sheedy's thrown on the ground. Burns breaks clear. Oh. He goes for a pass. It's a good one. Grabbed here by uh, by Brydis, who kicks the ball up towards the forward pocket. And a mark taken there by Dick Clark. And a 15-metre penalty against Wade. Wade will have an argument here, I'd say. He's bringing him back 15 metres. Brydis on the ground. Well, who's gone off, Lou? We'll pick it up in a moment. Maybe Baker. Let's see what's happened. The kick by uh, Clay up to the wing position. Oh, and a good mark by Green again. A hand pass to Sheedy playing a pretty good game. Beautiful play by Sheedy. Over to Burke. He's in trouble but still gets his kick. Up towards that uh, half forward line. Smothering the ball is uh, Montgomery but the ball is out of bounds. Out of bounds on that half forward line. This time for Richmond about... 80 metres around from their goal, in front of the members. Knocked out by Goodingham, picked up by Cable. The ball goes around towards uh, Bryant, he can't pick it up. Sheedy backing up, look at a free kick around the neck, and Sheedy takes the free kick on the wing. Over now to uh, Wayne Waltz. Wayne Waltz of Richmond tries to get it in towards centre-half forward. Sproul goes up, pushes the ball in front of him. That's called play on by the umpire. There could be a ball up here, and at this juncture we take great pleasure in welcoming viewers to this uh, grand final through NTD8 in Darwin. The first time ever we're going direct to Darwin, a grand final from Melbourne. We'd like to say hello to uh, Hunter Harrison, the president of the league up there, and we've co covered all Australia now from uh, top to toe. And there's a mark to Green. That's three marks he's taken already in this quarter. A long kick around towards the half forward line. Goodingham couldn't hold the mark. Cable's going after it. It's a quick kick. Back towards Walsh and Schimmelbush. But Schimmelbush has got his hit play on. Coming out of the pack is Felter. Back towards the wing position. The pack go. Punched away by McGee. Going out to the ball is Farron. He's got it. Oh, A free kick to Farron against McGee. And he takes the free kick on the wing position for North Melbourne. I'm beginning to think it could be Ryan who's off uh, Lou. Uh, Ryan's on the ground. Is he? So too is Baker, I think. Anyhow. As play goes on, doesn't give us much time to look around. Taken there by Michael Green, tries one over his head. Beautiful to Burke. Burke to Andrews. Andrews over here towards Kane. Kane of Richmond up to the half forward flank. They come out to meet it. Oh, there could be a free kick going to Hart. Hart is on the half forward flank on the stand side. He's kicked three goals. Did a lot of damage in that second quarter. The ball goes into the forward line. Knocked away there by Cable. Over to Feltham. Feltham of uh, North Melbourne. Kicks down towards centre half forward. Brightest behind. McGee in front. And McGee takes out the mark. A little wide of centre half uh, back towards the stand 
flank up towards centre half forward. No mark taken there by Cumming. Cumming a quick hand pass up towards Cloak. He's grabbed immediately. Actually smothered in comes Cable. Cable going for a bit of a run. Steadies. Kicks in here towards Feltham. Feltham takes the mark. Looks around for somewhere to go. Shoots it out towards the wing position. Schimmelbush is there. Pushes the ball in front of him cleverly. A hand pass across here towards Ryan. Ryan, oh, is he in trouble? But he gets out of it. Takes his kick to the half forward flank on the stand side. And up goes Richard Clay to pull down a ripper. For our friends up there in Darwin, we might introduce ourselves, Michael Williamson and my good friend Lou Richards to take over. Now there's the kick by Clay, uh, up towards centre field, knocked away by Goodingham. Going after the ball is uh, Barrett, picked up by Morris, wide out of the wing position. Running after is Rantel, it bounces right, he picks it up beautifully, out towards that half forward line. Burke, uh, Morris and, uh, and Burns, Burns having trouble, he bubbles the ball, he's got it now, he's attacked, he'll lose it. Umpire says playing as Wood picks it up. In a ton of time, hand pass from Cloak over to uh, Bartlett. Bartlett gets the ball around towards that half forward line. A desperate struggle going on by both sides at the moment as we see a free kick go to David Dance. Now it'll go there to, yes, to David Dance out there at half back. I'll tell you who's not out there, Barry Davis, the captain. And the ball goes around towards that uh, wing position where Goodingham gets the tap and the and the ball is out of bounds. He, it appears that Barry Davis may have had a, a knock on the leg and was forced to leave the ground at half time. Knocked out by Goodingham again, but Bartlett's there. Hooks the ball back over his head and it'll go out of bounds. And it'll be a throw in from that half forward line for Richmond, about 75 to 80 metres around from their goal. Lou, the loss of their skipper, Barry Davis, a prolific kick getter. Certainly won't help North Melbourne, but they're in there battling, up they go. Green tries to get the tap away, Goodingham's in there, picked up by Farron, couldn't get his boot to the ball, went tackled there by Wood, but eventually he does. Down towards centre half forward, coming out there is Kekovic. Kekovic over towards Ryan, Ryan backs back, eventually takes his kick into the forward zone. There's a close one. Forced through for one behind. And so Richmond, 11-11, leading North Melbourne, 8-4. 25 points of difference in favour of Richmond. The 1973 Premiers on top in their bid to take it out for the second successive year, but North Melbourne are in there. They're still battling on. Up they go. There's a long way to go. Taken by Cloak of Richmond. Cloak gets it out to the wing position on the outer side. Here's a race for the ball. Taken by uh, Royce Hart. Beautiful hand pass to Sheedy. Sheedy steadies. He drives downfield. There's nobody home. But here's a go for David Thorpe. He breaks clear, he kicks, and he's missed. Well, there was a sigh of relief from the North Melbourne supporters after that kick from Thorpe. They're leading by 26 points, Richmond. About uh, eight and a half minutes gone of this third quarter as the ball goes around to that half-back uh, line. Blind oh! That time was Baker. Baker now playing at centre-half back. Yeah, that was a good mark, Louis. Beautiful mark. Davis has left the field. It appears that he may have an injured leg. Up towards Goodingham and Green. Goodingham gets the lock. Peterson trying to get clear. Gets a hand pass to Bridus. Bridus with a pass to Kekovic. It's too long. In goes uh, Andrews. He's grabbed. He's knocked to the ground. Backing up well as Kane. Don't they back up those Tigers? What a beautiful back line as the ball goes back towards centre field. Ball over to Walsh. He fumbles the ball. He gets a nasty knock. And just now. Oh! one by uh, Barn that time and Burns will take the free kick a little short of centre half back oh bad pass to Rantel but he's grabbed it Rantel around the uh, outer side of the ground and a beautiful pass to Mark to Falter back to Green a bit confused that time Green hand pass back to Peterson back to Falter they're looking better now North up it goes back towards Sam Kikovic he's kicker smothers he fires for the goal as it go now as we see Brightest break clear Oh, he can't kick it. They're strong, those defenders, as we see uh, McGee throwing himself. But Peterson's got it. He's broken clear now. Up towards the three. The oh, he's got to get a free. Free kick to him. Interference. Got it. His shoulder's crooked too. He would have marked that one. He's had that crook shoulder for a little while, Lou. Yeah, he's had that crook shoulder against the uh, second semi-final, Waverley. He's already kicked three goals. 
Look at Wade, he scores a 15 metre penalty. penalty. This means that the Tigers have been wasting time. And Wade will be going for his uh, fourth goal. He wouldn't miss this in a million years. That's a goal to Wade. So they move to nine goals, four. 58 points. North Melbourne. The Richmond 11, 12, 78 points. 20 points the difference. A little over the 10 minute mark of this third quarter. Doug Wade getting attention from the head trainer of North. Ron House. Wade putting up a great performance because he's certainly against one of the all-time greats in Dick play. An awkward bounce in from umpire Robinson. Bartlett comes in. Bartlett putting the Tigers into a tackle. The half-forward flank on the outer side of the ground. Coming, uh, tries to do his bit. Eventually does so. Gets it over to Thorpe. Thorpe... No, we will not give North away. Up it goes again. Knocked out by Goodingham. A go now for uh, Burns to get clear. He was grabbed. A free kick to Burns. Burns at centre field. Axby's on the defensive side for North Melbourne. Oh, could be a free kick. He said play on, but backing up well. Here's Ryan. They back up beautifully, those uh, Tiger defenders. And Amado Mark to, uh, to play. It was picked up by Rantel. Rantel says that towards Feltham and Sheedy. Having a great battle. Feltham comes out. Good play by Feltham. As he kicks the ball around towards Wade and Clay. Oh, they both go in pretty hard. And he's paying a free kick to Clay. But golly, Wade's not too happy about that one. He wasn't happy at all about that play. Uh, Wade. Ball back towards that uh, wing position on the outer side. Hooked over by Burns. Oh, too far for Barrett. And punched away by Kane. Back towards Brown. A wild hand pass. Oh, they're going like bombs. We see the ball from half Play. the city. Back oh. to Wood. He can't pick it up. Backing up is Burke. A, a baker. But Hart picks it up again. A long kick. And a mark by Dance. A good mark. Plenty of pressure football at the moment. And that uh, North Melbourne defence under a tremendous strain down there at the moment. As we see Dent send the ball around towards the wing position. Oh, getting up high. That time was hard. Pushed away by Peterson. Grabbed by Burns. Over to Simmerbush. And North go to attack. Here's Peters. He's got an open goal. He fires. And it's a goal. Fourteen minutes into the third quarter, Arnold Brightus puts one through for the Kangaroos. Scoreboard reading, Richmond 12, 12, 84 North, 10, 4, 54, back to 64 rather, back to 20 points of difference in favour of Richmond and both teams giving their all and they're thrilling the capacity crowd, approximately 120,000 people here today and of course people right throughout Australia watching it live on the Channel 7 network. In comes uh, Barrett, gets it over to Greg. Greg going for a run, but the ball will be brought back. And listen to the crowd, it's certainly pro-North, but I don't reckon anybody there could say that Richmond isn't putting up a tremendous performance, and of course North are too. It's a beautiful game to watch, glorious to call. As Greg takes his kick now, it's a big one in towards centre half forward. Peterson's got the ball, a hurried kick, it rebounds. In comes Gareth Andrews, he's still going, well played Andrews. Knocked back by Goodingham of North Melbourne. It's a cameraman's nightmare at this stage. Taken there by Walsh, Walsh of Richmond gets it to the wing position. Oh, here's a race, it'll go over the boundary line. There wasn't a play within a bull's roar of it then. And there'll be a throw in between Richmond's half forward flank and the centre wing position. Throw in, Goodingham's there on his own, taps it down here towards uh, Schimmelbush. He's grabbed, tries a hand pass towards Burns. Is he in trouble? But he gets out of trouble. A desperate tackle there by Sheedy, he didn't come off. Down towards centre half, forward for more. Oh, Wade was shoved right out of it then. But still, play goes on. Kekovic comes through. Kekovic trying to use his strength. He goes over, it's called play on. Richmond are out of trouble. And uh, Morris Copman right on the nut there. And the free, I think, could be given downfield. It will be. Well, listen to the North Melbourne crowd. Are they dirty on umpire Robinson? Wood tried to break away, but it didn't come off. 
Gee, they're savage on the umpire, aren't they? The well, they are. I think a bit unfair that time as the ball is kicked up by Wood up towards that half forward line. And oh, back here, back oh, here. Back here, look at this. Back here now. They're really in one. Look at this going on. They're all having a go. Look. And the play is still going on down there. Players are falling over like nobody's. And there's a free kick down there to Richmond. And players going in like nobody's business. The umpire, the goal umpires, absolutely hopeless down there. Got no hope. There's another go going on. Look. Well, the, the field umpire hasn't spotted this at all. Well, uh, there's a chance for Richmond to go here. It's Sheedy with the ball. It's Sheedy with the ball up the other end of the ground and he's only 30 metres out he's kicked one goal it's on its way, it's swinging and one point results by golly that was pretty lively football down there, the, the field umpire didn't even know it was going on, so it's Richmond 12-13-85 to North Melbourne 10-4-64 and a mark taken there by Sproul at half, uh, half forward, Sam Kikovic must have got one in the nose Brown about 65 metres out from goal. Just about dead in front. A beautiful kick by Sproul. But it's up target and through for one point. So they move to 12-14. 86 points. Richmond to North Melbourne. 10-4, 64 points. And what a wild and woolly game it is. Oh, she's on again over there. Morris and Kekovic. And the ball is on the forward line for Richmond. Ryan coming out, kicks it in towards the centre. Sproul in front of Burns, it's not clear. McGee kicks it off the ground. In comes Baum. Baum moving beautifully. Kicks a long one down towards the forward pocket on the outer side. A chance for coming. Hart's in there. Coming, still going. Hand pass to Sheedy. Sheedy a long hand pass to Green. Green of Richmond, a hand pass back here towards Sheedy. Sheedy kicks it into the goal square. A go for the Tigers. Cloak was there. Cummings got it. Cummings snaps. Puts it through for one behind. Boy, is this entertainment plus. Well, keep your eye on number 38 for Richmond and number four for North Melbourne. They've been going hammer and tongs all day as the ball is kicked back into play by uh, North Melbourne. Out towards that wing position. Grantell going out. Oh, he got around the neck that time. Would have to get a free kick against Thorpe. And no big parties today. It's a real ring-a-ding-ding grand final. As we see the free kick go to Rantel with a 15-metre penalty. He's on the uh, wing position on the outer side. The kick out towards that half-forward line. The pack set themselves. Look at the pack there. The ball's pushed out the Falcon, but he can't get there in time. And it's out of bounds. About 70 metres around up on the North Melbourne ground. Oh, yeah. This is a dead-set pro North Melbourne crowd. You've got to wrap those Richmond defenders, Lou. There they go. Balm over the top of Kekovic, picked up by Thorpe. Uh, knocked away there by Arnold Brightus. In comes Peterson. Back to Kekovic. Kekovic steadies. He kicks. He's put it through. He's kicked how many goals? Two. And we're 20 minutes into the third quarter. There's the scoreboard. And there's a Richmond player in trouble. It's McGee, who's been playing beautifully too. It's in a half back. And the scoreboard, I lost sight of it then. Uh, so many things happening. 12-15, 87, Richmond, North Melbourne, 11 4 70, 17 points the difference. And there's the ball up towards centre half forward. Everyone trying their heart out. But the umpire will give a free kick to Blyders. He's about 65 metres out from goal. He's already kicked one goal. Brydas coming on, replacing Davis at half-time. Brydas, a dynamic player when he wants to let himself go. Gets into the goal square. The pack set themselves. They're all flying right at the back. Picked up that time by Clay. Gets the ball wide out towards that uh, half-back line. Backing up is Walsh. Couldn't pick the ball up. In goes Walsh again. Simabus has got him. Now he breaks away. He's playing strong football. Wade. And he's smart. The ball is out of bounds on the full. And a penalty free kick to go to Simabush. Look at that crowd going for North Melbourne. Oh, what a fantastic effort from Wayne Walsh, though, Lou. Great Ryan play. takes the kick into the forward zone again for North Melbourne. Wade goes up there. Ball comes to the ground. It's Kane of Richmond. 
takes it over the boundary line had such momentum up he just couldn't do anything about it a throw in that forward pocket for North Melbourne on the stand side there's Kekovic up goes Green Green taps it away in comes uh, Francis Burke Burke puts his boot into it in towards the centre of the MCG it goes they all play for it Cloak's got the run of the ball but misses it oh in comes Montgomery no free kick Montgomery still got it Gets it over towards Bradley Smith, he's in trouble. Back towards Montgomery, misses the run of the ball. In comes Cloak. Montgomery's there, but it's taken over the boundary line. And a free kick is paid to Montgomery. A free kick to Montgomery on the wing position. He has a bit of a run. Gets the ball across the centre half forward. It beats about five. Pushed away by Green. Over to Sheedy. Sheedy gets the ball, drops it short. Good play by Hart. Has a go now for coming. He's grabbed a hand pass over to Sproul. A long shot for goal, but he's off target. And the ball is through for one point or out of bounds. Out of bounds. Out of bounds, right against the point post. 22 and a half minutes gone of this quarter. And they're trailing by 17 points, North Melbourne. Bradley Smith has a go now for Thorpe. But he's off target. They've been kicking badly, Richmond. 12, 16, 88 for North Melbourne. 11, 4, 70 points. Waiting now for um, the ball to come into play. It's Baker kicking off this time. He's been moved around the ground a bit. Been a ferocious quarter this uh, third quarter. 23 minutes into it, the sun coming out. Who's it going to shine upon? Feltham. Oh, he will be awarded the mark. Top one on the nose for his trouble. And I don't have to describe that. 15 metre penalty, Mike. Yes, indeed. A 15 metre penalty. And this game is not over by a long shot as Feltham takes his kick to the wing position on the outer side. Up goes Greg. Behind was Brightest, but it's McGee standing firm as usual. Robbie McGee pushing the ball in front of him. In comes Daryl Cumming. A long hand pass finds Bartlett. Bartlett can't get his kick tackled by Pagan. Oh, there's another one going in there, but it's Bartlett with the ball. Bartlett into the forward zone for uh, Richmond. Barry Richardson is there. Oh, Montgomery will get a free kick here. Montgomery up north to take the free kick at the centre-half back position. Possibly a little short of the centre-half back position. Montgomery up north. His kick goes in towards the centre. Plenty of Richmond players there. Oh, Thorpe. Got one right in the back then, and it's called play on. Goodingham gets a free kick held while not in possession. Goodingham, oh, what's he going to do? Dummies a hand pass. Throws a short one overhead towards Ferrant. Ferrant kicks a long one. It's in the goal square. Up they go. No mark, however. Gareth Andrews is in there. Taken by Kane. Kane of Richmond kicks out towards a half-back flank. Plenty of uh, North players there. Taken by Shimmerbush. Tries to run too far. He's caught. It goes to Goodingham. Goodingham gets it over to Burns. Burns is tackled immediately by Cumming. Is this desperation football or is it? Cumming is still there. Cumming's got it. A hand pass comes over to Sproul. Tackled by Montgomery. Walsh is over the ball. Comes out with it. He's pushed over by Burns. And Burns comes out. Oh, they're getting tired. A high one to centre half forward. It's taken there by Shimmerbush. Shimmerbush kicks in forward. It's an awkward one. And Dick Clay beats it as it goes over the boundary line. There'll be a throw in in North's forward pocket. Out of bounds in the forward pocket. And what football this is. By golly, they're throwing themselves at the ball. Both sides. Back it goes now. Knocked out by Green. Coming and uh, Peterson having a go. But neither can pick it up. And the umpire will ball it up about uh, 15 metres out uh, from the North Melbourne goal. They're trailing by 18 points at the moment. Down she goes. Oh, the ball pushed out by kicker. It's not a good one. He goes after the ball again. And is it a, a free kick or a baller? And a ball it up. This time it's about 20 metres out uh, from that uh, North Melbourne goal. Plenty of Richmond defenders there. Kekovic again gets the knockout. But uh, too good this time as we see the ball taken away by Morris. But they're in the way. Oh, oh. line dropped an easy one. This allows the cloak to come after the ball. And he jumps it over the line and out of bounds. Out of bounds on the wing position, or up to the wing position on the member's side, and North Melbourne still trailing by 18 points. Ball back into play again. Goodingham at the back, got the nap down. Good pick up that time by Peterson as he shoots the ball around towards Cable. 
but it's out of bounds on Ooh. the ball. And a penalty free kick will go down now. There's Cable on the fence, he's okay. And a penalty free kick to go to Kane in the back pocket. Well, actually, he's up towards that uh, half back line. All players in readiness as he boots the ball back. Actually, with the half back line now, they all fly. Richmond players calling each other that time. Going after the ball is Sheedy. He can't pick it up, picked up by Sproul. Good play by Sproul as he gets the ball around. Just about a mark to Bradley Smith has played it. A free kick. And he's doing a great job down there in the back pocket as he did last week too. Smith driving Richmond out once again. The ball comes to the half-back flank on the member stand side. Hands reach high for it. Nobody comes out with it. Machidi gets it over to Mike Green. He kicks in the Goodingham over the line. It goes. There'll be a throw in. Richmond's half-forward flank on the stand side. Right in front of the smoker stand here at the MCG. The ball knocked over towards... Uh, Dench couldn't get a run of it. In comes Hart. Almost got a free kick too. Hart comes out with the ball. Kicks in goalwards. It's slightly across the face of goals. Up goes Baker and takes a beautiful mark. What a game this is. 18 points the difference in favour of Richmond. Kick out goes towards Keith Gregg. Rantel knocks it clear. But oh, there's only one man there. It's Kevin Morris of Richmond. Morris steadies. Kicks in at the big ones, but he's off target, I feel. And one point results. 19 points the difference now in favour of Richmond. Baker at fullback about to kick out. A thriller dilla. A ring a ding dinger, as Lou would say. Baker going to favour the outer flank by the look of it. There it goes. It's a nice kick, too. Right to the half back flank on the outer side. Oh, and Sheedy gets up. Used his opponent for leverage and took a great mark. Sheedy into the forward zone. Barry Richardson is there. Baker comes out in front and takes the good defensive mark. Baker now switches flanks. He goes looking for Goodingham. Oh, Goodingham gets a push in the back, not seen by the umpire. In they go, picked up there by Walsh. He loses it, taken by Goodingham. Goodingham gets it down into the forward zone for uh, North Melbourne. Riders comes out with it, but oh, he's lost it. And a free kick. They could be playing the mark. He should have. Riders gets it over to Cable. Cable into the forward pocket on the stand side, but over the line it goes on the full. Doug Wade looks at him as if to say, hell, what do you think I am? An orangutan, my arms aren't that long. Dick Clay to take the kick. Coming on the member stand flank. Lovely sunshine here at the MCG, which is pretty unusual for Melbourne in the football season. Goodingham marks. Great mark to Goodingham there on that um, centre wall, back towards the centre of the ground. Goodingham with the ball. It's a punt kick across the centre half forward. Brightest in front, oh, oh, good mark, that time by Green, a beautiful mark, by Green. Great timing, Louis. Great timing, he's taken quite a few good marks today as he gets the ball out towards Wood and Greig, they're having a great battle. There goes Greig, he's broken clear, gets the ball across towards Cable, and he's marked it. Cable's got the mark. He'd be about, uh, let's see, uh, about 60 metres out from goal, he's already kicked two goals. Cable. He's having a long kick, doesn't quite make the distance. Ball pushed out by Green, and the ball is out of bounds in the forward pocket position. Half for North Melbourne, about 25 metres around from that goal. And there is the sole. Scoreboard at three-quarter time in the 74 grand final. Richmond 12-17-89, leading North Melbourne 11-4-70.